Wave Time here, bringing to you another episode of Inferno Minds. So here we are in the Vexing Gallery. We just finished the Blackened Archives over there. So there was a bit of a recording issue that I had to take care of. However, I think I am good. There shouldn't be any more problems in the future. So here we are. And the next area that we're going to need to take care of is, well, there's one, there's two areas left. There's also that eternal battle that's over there. However, there's this Estonian battle cry that we definitely need to look at to make sure that we don't thoroughly, uh, well, that eternal battle looks like it's the very last area. But this area, if it's this Estonian battle cry, I don't even want to mock that. Um, let's just look at the area, then we'll check behind us. Okay, so natural zombie spawn, it looks like. This looks like a long hallway. Unless it's just not rendered properly, which is a possibility. I am on normal, good. And, okay, so there's some potions. It looks like regen and speed. Okay, regen, and we got some speed. If we can actually get a bit more speed. Okay, so let's go and just go all out on this area. Okay. These are all materials that can explode very easily. And yep, that's void. That's certainly void. Oh dear. And at least that's bedrock unless there's lava underneath. And let's uh go this way. Silverfish. Of course. Why wouldn't it be silverfish? Okay, so cactus head, I shouldn't let the stuff spawn. Okay, so zombie and cactus head. That means that I should use my smite sword. It'll be a bit more effective. Okay, let's go in and see what we can do. Let's lure the cactus head, or in fact, let's go and get you. Oh, witch spawner. Okay, let's get you. Ha ha! I said ha ha! Get knocked back, ah, fudge. Okay. Do I have any punch on my bow? Probably not, but let's get him far enough back. Okay, he's dead. And run over here. Okay, we got a bow, actually. That's good. Uh, what do we have here? Punch one, flame one, unbreaking one. That's not really useful. Unbreaking uh, three, not useful. Thorns. Bah. Whatever. Okay, so this seems... Oh! Is that the end? There's no way that's the end. It's so straight... Huh. Uh, one thing that I feel obligated to do, however, is get this stuff. And it seems like there's actually no levers under there, so it's just some sort of perpetual state of lightness. Uh, we should allow some form of pathway back that won't be slowed. I don't think it's necessary to have it fully enclosed and protected. That might have to come later, but we need to be able to run back whenever we need to without fear of uh, witches being a big annoyance. Okay, so ha! Ha! You shun! Ha! Come on! You have my permission to die. Oh, of course I had to hit you. There we go. Okay, so creeper on the side and go this way. In fact, the creeper might be the best, easiest way to do this. Okay. So there, you're dead. You can't really attack me. However, okay, apparently, oh my gosh. Nope, 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 nope. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse. Okay, let's get back. This might work. Yes, it does. Okay, so let's get you. You're dead. We have two cactus heads, and our regeneration is gone. Um, let's make sure we're actually in a good area. The flame is more so that you can't see what you're doing. Okay, um, let's see. Can we get you... Oh, my God. That was helpful. Ha! And damn, 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 damn. Okay, let's get you, let's get you. Oh, there's too many of them, there's too many of them, there's too many of them. Run back, run back while you still can, and of course you're still shooting at me. Cactus head, okay. So much for that, I'm just going to pop a derp. There's a pop a derp, oh, God. Hello, oh my God, you're like Speedy Gonzalez. 
Ah, if only you were a mouse, it'd be much easier. Okay, there we go. We got another bow. We can probably... Ah, bah. Ah, regeneration seems to be in order. Now, I'm thinking with this area, and probably with the future areas, these are going to be perpetually horrible. Oh, carrot. These are going to be horrible, and I'm thinking it might actually be a good idea to uh, make some sort of farm for potions, like get some sort of blaze farm going. We might spend an episode on getting that, but I think actually I don't want to do two things in one episode, so I'm thinking just gonna get this down. Ah, there's a, another cactus head. Okay, this takes priority. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, of course you have to be there. Ha! There you go. Ah. <laughs> They're such morons. I don't even understand how they can do that. Okay. Uh, <laughs> This seems straightforward. There's not many, uh, much in the way of tactics that I can impart on this. I just have to go pretty much full steam ahead and get them before they get me. Which is easier said than done, in all honesty. Considering there, there's witches and, uh, witches and witches and witches. At least I got the witches out. Huh. Oh, that was horrible. <laughs> Uh, the diamond armor does help greatly, though. Uh, let's get you out of the way. Does smite actually work on you? Hmm. Knockback does. Do I have a knockback sword? Uh, which one is the knockback sword? Knockback 2 and knockback 2. Okay. You are annoying. So get away. Oh, you... No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. Okay, let's get you on the other side. So that you don't actually come for me. Okay, so it does seem like... Oh, come on! There we go, you're dead. So it seems the main advantage of this is the separator. Oh. Is the separator so that they don't just randomly peel off in one... Oh, we should get you. Peel off in one direction. Uh, let's get you before you spawn another spawn. And then that's good. Okay. Um, let's take a breather. Let's take a breather. Okay, I'm thinking that we should do the same thing here. Then just call them these out and, prob nah. and probably just wait for the stuff that's going to be over there to despawn. So witches actually give quite a few potion ingredients, though I don't think I have any slime balls to make fire resist. Fire resist potions would be quite good. Um, and we do have a source of unlimited bottles, right? I think the wither skeletons on the path towards the victory monument actually allows for that, so that will be good. Okay, he can't get to us, however... Oh, of course you're there. Oh, I thought you were... Bah! Well, oh, there's a creeper. Hello. Nice to meet you. So much for the theory of them not going through fire. And I got slowed down. That's great. That's just perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, crud. Of course. Bah! Oh, and I'm slowed. That makes things oh so much better. Let's just jump over here and have a fun time at it. In fact, why don't I use my ender pearls? Because that would be a stupid idea. Ha! <sighs> so I thought originally that the fire was kind of like a retaining wall. They do not cross it, or at least they try not to. But it seems like they don't have any inclination that fire is bad. So I suppose... That is something to be interested in. Okay, we have to take him from this angle. Okay, come on. You're allowed to come over this way. Aha! Over here. Are you going to be just staring at me, you old cactus part? Ah, okay, your fire aspect is annoying. I'm going to kill you or just knock you off. There we go. Finally, okay, um, sugar, hmm, not going to be that useful, spider eyes not so much either, and we should light this up so that the, oh, potato, are you a spoiled potato or are you just a potato, are there, um, are these all natural spawns or is there a possibility of there being a spawner, oh, I shouldn't look away when there's a skeleton there, okay, so we got one other pathway down, and we got this going pretty well, uh, 
We didn't get the cactus head, though. I need a better bow. This bow doesn't... Ah, oh, fudge. Fudge, 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 fudge. Okay, come over here, cactus brains. Still following? Good. About time you're actually following the leader. Oh, crud. Sorry, did I insult your mother? Sorry, I thought... Ah, oh, she's such a lovely flower. Why don't you stop annoying me? Ah, oh, okay. Let's get you. Are you gonna follow this time? No? Just gonna go from a distance? That's good to know. Ha! Bye-bye. Okay, then. <laughs> uh, I hate you. Okay, so... Let's see. The ca Priorities. Priorities. Okay, priorities in killing spawners... I think is Estonians, then it's the uh, cactus heads, then it's the... Okay, that didn't really register. That's a block of diamond. Okay, so Zestonians, i.e. pigmen, uh, cactus heads, then witches. I think that's the order that we're going to want to uh, kill them in, the spawners at least, because that's their danger level. Considering that Zestonians are very fast in spawning, that's main, mainly the reason that we want to get them out of the way before anything else. So, block of diamond. What are we going to do? Uh, maybe we should put that in the ender chest so we can keep it safe. I'm not sure if there's any reason to get it right now. Well, the fact that it's in the way of my path is one reason, and I think the main reason of why we'd want to get it. Okay. So get you. Get you. And are there no cactus heads there? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, let's take this. Oh, great. That's a good way to kill me. Uh, let's get you out of the way. Let's run back. And, oh, this is so much slower than without... Ah, uh, hmm. Actually, I think there's a... No, that might only be in modded Minecraft. There's an enchantment on boots that gives haste. Allows you to run a lot faster. Maybe I should work... To, or at least I'll check Minecraft Wiki, see if that's actually an enchantment I can get in vanilla Minecraft. But otherwise, it might be a good one to get. Okay, you're in here. And let's get you to a regeneration snuff. Okay, we don't need you. Not really necessary at this point. We'll probably need to make another set of diamond armor at a later point in time when... Is two minutes of speed enough? No, not really. Can you give me some more speed? Three minutes, probably enough. Okay, so let's go in and see what we have. You could probably replace this as well because it might blow up somehow. Though, Ender Pearls seem like the way to go if we need to run back very, very, very quickly. Okay, nothing spawned. There's another block of diamond. Though that may be a feint. Ah, we should get that in... Yeah, there, okay. Ah, two Zisonians. Oh, of course you have to slow me. And poison. Are you happy now, Vex? Are you happy? You have poisoned me and slowed me and hurt me with your infernal witches. A witch? Okay, that is... I gotta get back. Uh, just in case, just in case... Okay, uh, got you almost dead, and got me almost dead. Thank goodness for protection, and you're dead. Okay, uh, regeneration is a bit low. I can, uh, we need to get at least one spawner for this to be worth it, or else it's just going to be annoying, okay? Of course it has to be behind that, and a cave spider. Up, oh, run, 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 run. I don't need this. I don't need this. I can go with you, though. And a cactus spawned. Ah, okay, gotcha. Gotcha. Ha! Okay, you're dead. Okay, now we need to get some more regeneration before we die. Ah, this, we're making progress. We're definitely making progress. However, I don't know if it's a fast enough progress. There's only one way to find out. Hmm. I'm wondering when the other Let's Players are going to make this area, because I have been... Um, lately, I've noticed that I'm taking these areas a lot faster than other Let's Players. For instance, 
I know Zisto is on episode 50. I'm on like like 30 maybe? Less than 30 and I'm much farther than him. Maybe I maybe I should make some sort of grinders. I guess I'm not much of a vanilla player. That could be one of the reasons why I'm taking this a much more fast approach. Or who knows how good I am compared to them. I, I'm not really measuring that. Okay, so you're gone. And there's still another Zisto spawner as well as a cactus head. Though we did get... Okay, there's also a witch. And I think those are the only ones. Okay, got you. Got you. Up. And got you. Okay, knew you were here. <sighs> okay, there we go. And we got a zombie. And a whole mess of signs. Okay, let's let you burn. Uh, do we have any room? Yes, we do. And I'm wondering, is there any s spawner there? No, it has to be natural spawns. There's no way that it's regular uh, spawners. Okay, so get you and work on our way back so we don't get slowed. There we go. Okay, I'd love to read those signs. Though that's much more than he usually gives in the scientist bar. That's the fleecy box. That is definitely the fleecy box. That was early. And this area was a lot easier than I thought it'd be. Ah. Hmm. One question I have is if the proximity of those spawners, as in it's not just a 16 area, can be altered so that instead of having it over there, it'd be over there. That would explain a lot. Though maybe I'm overthinking things. Okay, um... I know it's just over there, however, I do feel a little uh, caution-y. Let's get that guy also, Creeper Spawner. I feel a little cautious. I need to be cautious. I really need to be cautious, so I'm just going to light up this area as a backup route, just in case there's some sort of TNT spawner, because I have no idea what to uh, make of Vex. Uh, that should be enough to get some natural spawns out of the way. That'll be good. Let's, uh, freshen up with our speed potion shower. Then we can go on with the regeneration as well. Uh, where is everything? The diamond blocks also we should get out of the way. I'm just going to move the two diamond blocks. So we got three diamond blocks out of this. That's enough for another set of armor. And I'm thinking, uh, before we tackle the final area, since this place is almost done... We should go and go to the other areas and loot as much of the diamond gear as well as the enchanting books as we can. We are probably also missing... Hmm. We should probably also go into the... Not the desert. Not the black desert. What are you talking about? Um... Uh... Come to me. Come to me. Uh... The... Basically the woody area. Yeah. The lush ruins. There we go. We should probably look at that a bit. I think four minutes is enough. So, escape plan, ready to go. And... Ugh. Okay. <sighs> Don't know what to expect about this. Okay, um, first of all, we should uh, top up our hunger. Check what we have. We got some... enough of those. Punch 2, Flame 2, that might be good. Power 3 is enough for me, though, and we got all that we need. Okay, so just need to run into here. Let's see what we have. That's a lot of signs. Let's go from the side. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my God. Red Wolf. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Get back, you fiends. Fiends, fiends, all of you. You are all fiends. Get back, get back, get back. Okay, I'm back. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What the heck is that? What the heck is that?
Oh my gosh, um... I gotta get back there. How many... Blazes... Things... What? Okay, that's a lot of blazes. And this is probably the safest that I can be. Um, wondering what's special about these. They were screaming a lot, so there must be something special about them. Uh, okay. Oh, diamonds? What? There's diamonds here? Okay, I'm, I'm in over my head. I am in over my head. I am definitely in over my head. Then why am I still here? Okay. Um, is that free diamonds? Oh my goodness. So I can... Ho! Oh. Oh, hello. How are you? So... That means that this is a... Oh, gosh. Um, yeah, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Uh, yeah, I'm out here. Okay, I gotta take a minute to digest this. Oh, and that's out? Okay, so this is not... Uh, gas proof. That's not gas proof. Uh, let's pick up the wool. Do we have any room for wool? No, we do not. Uh, signs by. Pick this up and. Oh my gosh. So let's take inventory of what we have. Uh, we got some screaming experience. So this is our experience farm, so to speak. And. Wondering, are there spawners in that? Customs position spawners so that they activate when they're over there. That might be the case. Um, okay, so we got the red wool. We got some uh, soul fragments. Okay, and we got some screaming diamonds. Uh, yes, so this area... I wouldn't say conquered. I wouldn't really say conquered. However, we may want to revisit this uh, later. Ah, conquered enough. Now that I think of it, those signs. What did they say? Though considering there was no protection over the signs, I doubt we were actually meant to read those. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, so we're done that area. We got some blaze rods if we want to make some potions. I can probably uh, go through... Uh, yeah, next episode we're probably going to want to go... Uh, through the areas that we already travel to and see if there's any potion ingredients. You know what he probably would have done is have custom spawners in this area. That's probably just mean. Okay, so I'm thinking that we're going to want to uh, bring this red wool back to the base and then place it on the monument and see what type of wool we're going to need. I think we have every wool except the black wool and the gold block. So revisit past areas see what type of things that we're going to need because potion ingredients are definitely going to be a must and actually retackle some areas to see if we can uh, better secure them because I think I definitely don't secure areas as much as I need to okay see you back at the monument so here we are the red wool it's definitely was an interesting experience probably well definitely not an easy area to conquer however we did manage to conquer it so let's bring this back on there we go so let's see that looks very complete that just looks so close to perfection i could almost hug it like hug 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 Hugging diamond blocks is probably a little weird, so I think I'll refrain from doing that. So we're missing the head of Code Warrior, the instigator. Anything down there? No? No, okay, good. And we're also missing the gold block as well as the black wool. The black wool is going to be, um, unless he's a gigantic troll, be in the eternal battle area. I don't, I'm definitely not ready for that area. However, I think what we should do is probably um, try to reconquer the area that's over there and try to get a much better uh, potionable area. Hmm. Is that a pathway? No, that's probably just glass. Um, nothing down there. 
at least nothing that I can see. Nothing that would be worth uh, just going down there and dying. Okay, so we're going to definitely want to see what we're going to do next episode. I'm not too sure. I'll have to think about it, mull over my mind, probably shoot myself with a few arrows, but that's something that we'll have to figure out next time. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode of Inferno Minds. If you like what you see, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe to future episodes. Wave time here. Signing off. Have a wonderful day.